The word for today, reasons for discontent. Let's take a moment to understand some of the reasons for discontent. One, looking for happiness in the wrong places. God said, my people have done two evil things. They have abandoned me, the fountain of living water, and dug for themselves cracked cisterns that can hold no water at all. Jeremiah 2, 13. There is an emptiness inside you that only God can fill, and he will if you invite him in. 2. Failure to serve others. How we treat others is often a reflection of how we feel about ourselves. Philosopher poet Eric Hoffer said, The remarkable thing is that we really love our neighbor as ourselves. We do unto others as we do unto ourselves. We hate others when we hate ourselves. We are tolerant towards others when we tolerate ourselves. We forgive others when we forgive ourselves. We are prone to sacrifice others when we are ready to sacrifice ourselves. It is not only love of self but hatred of self which is at the root of the troubles that afflict our world. 3. Comparing ourselves with others. Paul writes, Rejoice with those who rejoice. Romans 12:15. When you resent someone else's achievements or blessing, joy drains out of your body like a sieve. The Bible says, For as in one body we have many members, and the members do not all have the same function, so we, though many, are one body in Christ, and individually members one of another. Having gifts that differ according to the grace given to us, let us use them. Let love be genuine. Abhor what is evil. Hold fast to what is good. Love one another with brotherly affection. Outdo one another in showing honor. Romans 12, 4-10 That's the word for today.